just quick update to our earth bug house guys so this is our earth bug house for now like that I'm gonna show you in the front so this is our front now So today we're going to the city guys because we're gonna update to our, our Wi-Fi because the I know the Starlink still not arrived yet more than two weeks already uh, the LBC is keep trying to contact me they said but no one contact us so now we're going to Tagum to go to the LBC so, diba? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to go to Tagum to... Delivery hub to see yes. whether it's sat there. It's so long, they keep... I've had a message from Starlink saying the delivery company's trying to contact me, but we've got no mobile signal here. Yeah. And I'm not sitting on the edge of a road with a signal all fucking day waiting for a call from LBC. And we've been already there the other week to follow up about that as well in the LBC and DHL but they said nothing welcome to the Philippines yeah it's really struggle guys that's why now we're going back again because they give another uh, location where is it yeah well I've just looked up for the delivery hub because that's where all the parcels yeah. waiting to go out for delivery will be so yeah let's go guys let's go. <laughs> so we're going Don't now get excited yeah, hopefully we can get it because it's more than two weeks already, guys. Until now, no Starlink here. So this is the front of our earth bug house, guys. And that's the blacksmith there. And that's the view over here. We have new plants of banana over there. So yeah, see you in Tagum, guys. Bye for now. So hi guys, actually we're here already in Tagum City and this is crazy. We look around here, the LBC, you know, LBC, what you call that shop? LBC Courier. And we never found where is our Starlink is. The first LBC we went to, Yeah. the depot, distribution depot, is closed, is closed up. So. Yeah. We, we then Google another address. Yeah. And then we go to an LBC store. Mm -hmm. And they said to us, voila, we shall phone <laughs> the local st um, distributor. Nothing. We'll phone Davo. Nothing. Yeah. So we thank them for all the useful information they give us. We walk across the road, yeah. get in the car. Yeah. And hey ho. LBC from Davo, who the yeah. guy is supposed to have just called. He just called us. Said, we have your parcel. Yeah. Can we confirm your address? So we've confirmed the address and it should be with us within two to three business days, whatever it's, that means here. Yeah, it's already more than one week, guys, our parcel in Davao because they say they keep trying to contact us but we don't have signal over there and they know already that's why we order Starlink because it's rem remote. like remote area no contact you know and then they keep they, they won't deliver without uh, contact first us so exactly we're going home then they call and yeah so at least now we are we know where the parcel yeah. is and we know a rough time now yeah so it'll be after the weekend maybe monday or tuesday next week we should receive it and yes it's a, we we feel i know we feel better now that we know where is it well it wasn't a wasted journey to tag them because at least yeah. we got signal whilst we were here because this is the second time that we go here to you know to chase, look chase to chase parcel. Even we went to the HL, the, the guy there trying to help us out as well. He, he contact everyone and then he cannot trace because they not you know they, they did not give us the 
tracking, tracking number. number that's why they struggle and this time as well the LBC man he keep calling a lot of the you know LBC people workers if there is a parcel there but nothing so at least now the Starlink is coming soon maybe hopefully I know Monday because two to three working days so, so today is um Friday so tomorrow and Sunday are not working days yeah. so, so I reckon Tuesday or Wednesday next week now we are here at Tagum City <laughs> so we're going way back home now we just pass in different way different shortcut and yes at and uh, feels good now called us and yes it's in Dabo already yay hey my husband yesterday he went to higher place to get signal because they said the LBC people will call him around 11 a.m. and signal until 12 30 yeah nothing. it's like more than one hour there he keep waiting and nothing's happened it's really Filipino time guys so for now we're going there somewhere there in 7-eleven because someone so thirsty keep hunting our parcel where is it <laughs> and after this home time so we're gonna park here look look guys um, so lots of cars over here and what's this arrow now? Dabo de no del Norte. Ah, oh, that's why there's Paris Wheel and oh, there's a lot of you know like that like that. Mm. Nicole Rio really, uh, different places. Dabo del Norte It's full part of Dabo del Norte So Yeah, that's why a lot of people Oh Is this new land bank here? Oh New? Is it old? I just see that now Land bank So this is the Pond guys Dabnor. I don't know what is in here. It's near where the LTO testing center is. Mm -hmm. So lots of um, palm trees and there's a acacia tree as well. guys so this is earth bug house and here is my sweet corn i plant sweet corn guys in the front and this is moringa like malungay here and alugbati which, which is spinach so i plant some vegetable here in the front of our earth bug house and our corn is like more than they are more than one week old guys and i plant as well banana banana over there you see there's banana so in this line there is a uh, poor banana and here's our corn here sweet corn sweet corn all over there guys so as you can see i put um thick because a lot of people just walk in my plants they just you know they don't care so i put sticks in it and i plant as well some flowers here in this line as you can see we still have corn and our farm 
foxtail palm is getting bigger guys they're getting bigger now and that's how it looks there and this is our panda taki plants I line it all over there some plants here Comintang plants. That one is Adelpa, the pink one. And this one, I forgot what's the name. And this one is the dwarf yellow bill, guys. The dwarf, the dwarf one. And I have lots of Bugimbilia. Uh, this is not a dwarf. This is bigger than the one, the flowers, as you can see. Yeah, this is the update guys in our earth bug house in the front so that's how it looks now getting there and that's how earth bug house so far so good since we move in here and yeah and actually guys i have loads of gingers here as you can see oh from my neighborhood it's very generous to give us five five sacks of um, ginger because this sack uh, what you call this something like this guys uh, this is from our flooring when we concrete our floor and they ask all of our sacks that's why they plant uh, ginger and they give us back because this is the sack is from us and this is the okra guys so non-stop fruiting every day we always harvest another another okra guys and there's another one there's a lot more above it's getting taller it's every day we always get okra here and there's another okra over there Somewhere there, there's a lot of opera guys, and yes, that's our earth bug house. So, bye for now, guys.